We rolling. You know what it is, man. DJ Thorough, aka Thorough Zano. Brits to the streets. Right now, you're watching the hottest in the streets. Right here on ThisIs50.com. We live from One World Studio. Shout out my man, Boy Wonder. You know how we do. Special guest in the building. And he came bearing gifts, see? Yeah, yeah. Your artists can learn a lot, man. You got merch. You got a business. Bring me some merch, man. Bring me a gift. Or oh, your interview's not coming out. No, I'm not coming out. <laughs> <laughs> Introduce yourself. Mula da Vinci, straight out of Joy Sound, South Carolina. Oh. You know what I'm saying? Straight off the plane to go fuck with my dog, Tharazana. Right, I like, I like you that, know man. What I'm saying? I, I, I fuck with this straight guy, off man. The plane, you know All right, what South Calculac in the building. Yeah, yeah. All okay. right. All right, so listen, I'm going to ask you a simple question. And the answer better be yes. Can you rap? Of course. <laughs> I said, say yes. You see how I read it? Listen to this one in the middle. He didn't say yes. I said, yes or no. He said, of course. Of course. <laughs> he make his own rules. I like that. Big, big L said, never had rules to follow. None of my jewels are hollow. Mm. Try to tax me and you'll be on the news tomorrow. Talk Come to on, him. baby. Talk to him. Come on, baby. Like that shit with uh, him and Hov. Come on, man. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man. yeah. man. That's probably one of my that's best the, Yo, he, listen. That's one of the greatest. That's one of the rap, greatest like representations. Goldies, go back like the oldies, but the goodies. Pulling R&B bitches wearing hoodies. You know what yo, I'm saying? Yo, that's like, one of the greatest representations of what an MC is. That Big L and Jay-Z freestyle. Yeah. That shit is legendary. Nice. Crazy. Love so, it. with all that being said, man, since you can spit and you got bars, I need to hear something. You're on the spot right now. <laughs> and, you, and, you, and you said Big L was one of the people you listened to. So, yeah. I'm telling you now, I, I gotta put pressure on you. <laughs> all right? You better be dope like Big L. All right? all right? You better be hot like LL. Come on, man. All right? It's Carolina shit. All right, I know, I know what's up with Carolina. <laughs> I know. Come on, Raleigh Durham, baby. I know what's going on with the Carolinas. You know what I mean? I got family there. You know what I mean? Come on. Like I said, everybody from New York yes, got sir. somebody in Carolina. Yes, sir. Straight so the they, they may not know it, but you do. You came from down there. Mm -hmm. Everybody. That's a fact. But anyway, let's get into it, man. Let them know the name. Give us something hot. Give us something. Mula I don't care what it is. Joy Sound, South Carolina. Let me talk to him. Let's go. Talk to him. Listen, me. I've been a thorough nigga from the beginning. From my area, if you hungry, then you got to go and hunt for your dinner. Stomping niggas like a punk from a kicker until he brand dead. But I'm going to make sure that I'm the one he remember. Joy Sound on my back and I wear it with pride. I'm going to get under your skin, then I'm tearing your hide. Tell the truth. I know you fearing a guy. You would have thought he was Denzel from Glory with the tears in his eyes. I don't got to chase clout to be a notable figure. Wouldn't even post a picture if I'm posted with 50. If 50 was to give me a bag, I'ma hustle in the streets, give me a minute, then I'm bringing it back. Carolina nigga born and raised. Hitting niggas for a 20 piece for a .7 a haze. A young nigga, but I'm stuck in my ways. I'm handing L's out. You would think the GDs was up in the place. Listen, I love spitting balls. Choker when I stroke her, then I smack her on her ass. That's the only time I hit abroad. They know I'm a bigger dog. Great Dane, Dana Dane, nightmares, feel the pain. Things just don't feel the same. I ain't never switching lanes. I just stay in mind. Getting money to the lawyers for my niggas facing time. Got a problem with my bro that I'ma make it mine. Flow dope like some coke. I got niggas taking lines. Everybody asking questions, who was Mula Da Vinci? Soft CAC represented with the power like 50. Common sense ain't common. I can rap about myself, but I'd rather show the people love and pay homage. A lot of niggas hating on me lately, all that shit is a must stop. My money keep inflating like a bitch with a butt shot. I come from the bottom, but my rhymes is up top. Dirty South Calabas, a little nigga, just come shop. Woo! Yo! I'm a bar catcher. That real shit you said was if you took a picture with 50, you wouldn't even post it. You wouldn't even post it. Yo, yo, you made pictures I got with 50 that I ain't post? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm that type of nigga. Cut from a different flow. I'm a different nigga, B. You know what I mean? I'm making drop offs too, B. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? That easy. I mean, when they got pictures from 50, you know when you post them, man. Ain't no need to, man. You know where we at with it. Come on. You know what I'm saying? Man. We ain't here for the clout. Matter of fact, 50 better post the picture. I ain't posting that shit. You post it. Story and everything. <laughs> exactly. Now, real talk though. I get it, man. You don't trace clout, man. Yeah, man. That's I dope. That. Like, he said if I took a picture with 50, I wouldn't even post it. How many of y'all can say that? Oh, no. Nah, you know niggas get on that Instagram yeah, real quick. 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 Yeah, Shout out to my dog. Quick. <laughs> my dog, right? right. Nah, that's dope. Yo, that was dope, yo. Sure. That was dope. I, I, I hear it. You, 
I'm a fan now. Appreciate it, my dog. You know what I mean? Appreciate I, it. I, I'm a fan now. <laughs> wow, that was dope. All right. So you in the city, man. This your first time in New York? Nah, nah. This is probably like my fourth time. Fourth time? Yeah, you like it? Time. Hell yeah. And I love the culture. Like, I love this whole environment. Like, right. growing up as a kid, that's the shit that I always looked up. Movies, songs, all New York right. type vibe. You know what I'm okay. saying? So this no. shit is always love for me. So, all right. So you in the city, man. What we promoting? What we got our music What's going on? Shit, we got Protect Your Peace out right now. You know what I'm saying? Just dropped another uh, release, Dream Chasers. You know what I'm saying? But uh, Protect Your Peace, that's just kind of what we pushing right now. You right. know what I'm saying? Now, is there a video for any of this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all can go on YouTube, at Moonlight Da Vinci. That's my YouTube channel. Protect Your Peace dropped right. already. All right. Now, um, Protect Your Peace. Uh, speak on that for people that may not know what is, what's the meaning behind that. Yeah, man. This was like a period of my life where I was really going through a lot of shit, man. You know what I'm okay. saying? Like, as humans, you know what I'm saying? Because we forget being in the industry or, or pursuing our career that we still humans at the end of the day. Right. You know what I'm saying? So it was just me kind of doing some self-awareness mm. and me finally realizing, like, I got to stop letting that negativity run my life. You know what I'm right. saying? Like, stop letting the anxiety, the depression, all of that shit. So it was just one day, I'm like, yo, man, I'm protecting my peace from all this bullshit. I, I just kept telling myself that to right. boost myself up, to like train my mind and just not be negative. You know what I'm saying? So uh took that shit to the studio, you know what I'm saying? And Beast, right. Beast came up and I cooked that motherfucker up. Right, now you grew up in South Carolina, correct? Huh? You grew up in South Carolina? Yeah, 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 yeah. Isn't um, Zion, Zion Williams, Williams from South Carolina, Yeah, right? yeah, so he's from Carolina. Carolina. So we from yeah. different parts, though, from but different he parts. definitely from Carolina. Right. So, um, Carolina's always been like North Carolina, South Carolina. Everybody from New York got somebody in their family from North Carolina and South Carolina. For and sure. that goes back to slavery. Like, half the people, like, technically, everybody from up north is from down south. Right. Because they migrated, you know, slavery, whatever, whatever. But I said, I like to say, influence-wise, musically, who were you growing up listening to? Being from South Carolina, uh, it was a big pot, man. But like for real, it was Cash Money. I knew it. No <laughs> limit. You know what I'm saying? Shit like that. And then, and then, yeah, yeah. Like everybody wanted to be a hot boy. You a hot know what I'm saying? Right? Like, everybody right. wanted to be a hot boy. So yeah, I, I definitely grew up. Goddamn, getting a little Cash Money chain, thinking I'm, <laughs> thinking I'm Turk. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh. Shit. I was Turk, man. My homeboy right. was then Wayne, you know what I'm saying? Right. We had BG, all that right. shit. And like, we used to just watch Bala Blocking. But then that shit kind of went to um, fucking listening to my brother shit, you know what I'm saying? Like, he used to just buy a bunch of Jay Z, you know what I'm saying? Best of both worlds, you know right. what I'm saying? The Dynasty, you know what I'm saying? Then, then Fab and, and, and Beans, and right. you know what I'm saying? So, him being about three years older than me, I'm still like, we still like neck and neck in a sense. So, I'm listening to what he listening to, and then. That's where the major influence came from. Mm, okay, so you lean more towards, I would say, New York artists in terms of... Um, yeah, sound, yeah. In terms of sound or yeah. whatever. Mm -hmm. That's that's very rare nowadays, you know what I mean? Yeah. In terms of someone being from that far down south. Right, right. You know I mean, especially in this climate, because you got people from here that don't sound like technically. Nah, that's... You know, know what I mean? Right. Like, yeah, yeah, it, yeah, So that's very, that's very rare. So would you consider yourself a lyricist or MC? Like, what, where are you at with it? Um... I would definitely consider myself an MC mm. and a lyricist, and I say MC because I really try my best to like study hip hop. You know what I'm saying? So it's just like I learn every day, but I'm interested in learning. You're interested you know what I'm in saying? learning. So, right. so back then, you know, they used to label themselves as MCs. You know what I'm saying? Right. So that's, that's who a I, ceremony. If people yeah, yeah. don't know. So that's who I aspired to be growing right. up. You know what I'm okay. saying? Okay. So who were some of your favorite MCs that you like? Uh, shit. I like Big L. Stop right there. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Yo, you know that's my favorite rapper, right? Oh, for real? Oh, oh, no, excuse me. He's not a rapper. He's an MC. That's my favorite MC of all time. Yeah. Here you go. Damn, you don't even got to name nobody else, but give me one more. I need to ask you for five. Shit, I, uh, this shit. This big L. The fuck oh, with LL too. Oh, so how can people get in contact with you? How can they follow you? Make sure y'all follow me on Instagram. Well, really all social media at Moolah Da Vinci, and make sure y'all follow the brand at Dirty South Calabasas. Right. The, now, what's interesting to me is, this, we have this narrative of hip hop that if you're from down south, you gotta rap a certain way, and blah, that's bullshit. That's bullshit. Outkast proved that, T.I. proved that, Scarface proved that. You know what I mean? Right. Don't matter where you're from, you still gotta say something. Exactly. Lil Baby, niggas don't give, Lil, Lil Baby can spit. Like, 
You know what I mean? Yeah. He got the ball, heaviest ball. southern draw in the world, but he's 15. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Talking so it, it don't matter where you're from, man. You still got to say something. I don't care if you're from the Bronx, North Carolina, Oklahoma. You got to be talking about some shit, man. Right. You got to be, you know what I mean? That's just my perspective on how, how I want to hear it. You know, and Content matters, man. Yeah, you got to have it. You know what I mean? Definitely. So listen, man. That was dope. Appreciate I don't say that, that about everybody. No worries. All right? This, I knew you was going to be dope when you said Big L. Hey, your man came in here with the Yankees on. You see that? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Shout out to my nigga Al Green. Al Green, baby. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Phil Jackson. Yeah, that's Al Green's son, right? No, I'm <laughs> <laughs> Al Green Jr. <laughs> oh, but by the way, uh, Al Green's from Memphis, Tennessee. You know what I mean? People don't know that. You know what I mean? So, I sold me all that soul yeah, shit, yeah. the deep soul shit, mm -hmm. Isaac Hayes and all that, the sound of Memphis. Yeah. yeah. A lot of people, I mean, I mean, since we on this South shit. Talk to you. A lot of people don't know that hip hop was technically started in the South. Technically, it was started in the Bronx, but the music, you know who's from the South? I'm gonna give you a hint. Hey! James Brown. James Brown. That's Straight the music we were playing. That's the, that's the B Boy anthem, you know what I yeah, mean? Yeah. Funky Drummer. Mm -hmm. He's from Augusta, Georgia. Oh, that shit just stemmed from yeah. that, you know what I'm saying? So that sound was, a, that's some southern shit, but. And shit, we, we still took, using samples yeah, we to still, this day, still, you know what I'm saying? Funky Drummer is the most sample record in hip hop history. Google it. Funky Drummer. Shit, shit. Those drums are the most sampled, and in Peace the President. So I even got a song with that sample in You see that? You ain't got a song with that. You ain't got a song with that, you ain't hip hop. You ain't hip hop. You ain't hip hop. There it is. <laughs> All right, man, so listen, before we get out of here, man, is there anything else you want to speak on and chop it up that we didn't touch on? Nah, man, I just want to make sure that y'all just follow me on all social media. We on the Is Up 2 tour right now, so I had to go pull up on my dog, Thorozano, you know I, what I'm I saying? I love it, man. Make sure y'all fuck with the brand, Black on Business, Dirty South Calabasas, you know what I'm saying? We bring awareness to the South, you know what I'm saying? I know it's a stigma with the Dirty South, but we you better broke, than you, the Calabasas, you, 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 you know broke what I'm that, saying? You broke that stigma, bro. That's what we do, so no just stigma. make sure y'all fuck with it. It don't matter where you're from. If you dope, you dope. That's it. So, and to be honest with you, a lot of people from here, West Coast, uh, can take notes from you. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Right. You don't gotta follow trends. Be, do what you do. All right. From you the heart, though. You can either fit in or stand out. You know what I mean? Don't be influenced. Be the influence. That's real. All right. And like always, when you see us, one knee us. I mean, pay respect. Yeah. Ooh, I got bars too. You know. Thirty men. Thirty men. I'm on something. Ten men. Twenty men.